so let's get ahead in the docker journey and let's understand how so how this modern applications like the react angular and node.js is work okay so in this video what we are going to do we are going to just uh, clone this uh, the repo over here to, into my system so we have this react application onto my repository so you have to just go ahead in my repository like github.com and forward slash ruid dash marathe and then you have to go in the repository and over here I have one react app is known as a tic-tac-toe so I'm just going to open in the new tab okay so as you can see that this is my react application of tic-tac-toe so I have this tic-tac-toe application okay and you can able to download this uh, using the zip or you can just copy this command okay so I'm just copy this link and use the git clone method so I'm just using the git clone and paste the repo link here and it's automatically going to clone this repo into my directory uh, into my folder okay so if I do ls and as you can see that it's successfully cloned so once you clone the repo or if you have downloaded the zip then you have to drag that folder in the VS code so I'm just going to drag that folder in the VS code so okay so let me zoom in so as you can see that we have this files over here okay all the files over here so once you drag and drop the folder then you have to again comes on the repo here okay so if you scroll down little bit so as you can see that we have this installation process so if you want to run this application this react application so you have to first clone this repo then you have to use the npm install then you have to use the npm start okay so this is a step you have to follow if you want to run this react application and one thing you have to be noticed so in your system before uh, performing this task like the npm install and the npm start you have the must the node.js install into a system without node.js you cannot able to install this react application into a system so let's get started and perform all the commands and let's see our application is working or not so i'm just open this terminal over here and first thing i'm just going to cd in the my directory so i am in my tic tac toe directory okay the first step that you have to do you have to just clone this repo so we have already cloned the repo then you have to use the npm install command so using the npm install it's going to install all the dependencies of that application so application needs some of the dependencies before the running so it's going to install all the dependencies okay then we have to use the npm start and it's going to start the application as well so first thing what we are going to do we are going to just copy this one the npm install and paste this command should I paste it? Let's type the npm install. Okay. And let's wait. And as you can see that uh, the installation process is started. And within a second, uh, the, all the packages will be installed into our system. So as you can see that we have successfully installed all the dependencies. And now I have to run this application. So for that, I have to use the npm start. Okay. So I'm just using the npm start. And if you do npm start, it's going to start within a second. Yeah. And as you can see that we have successfully, okay. Uh, if I, let's try it's working or not. Okay. So as you can see that we have successfully run the React application, the tic-tac-toe application into a system locally. And we have first cloned the repo. Then we have used the npm install for installing all the dependencies. Then using the npm start, we have start the server and as you can see that it's uh, on the port 3000 and our application is working fine. Okay, so everything is done up here and see you guys in the next video.